Hello Sampersons and welcome back to another story time video. I haven't done one of these in such a long time. Um, the last time I did one was like months ago. I don't even know when. And I was like, hey, I should do an, a video like story time. And so I'm doing one and I'm here with you. First thing first is I'm going to tell you a story about how I got scammed from a break world. It was some crazy stuff, and it's actually happened more than once, but I'll save the other Break World story for another time. But for now, this is the, f the story. I'm going to tell you. Alright. So, pretty much what happened was, I was in a Break World uh, for my very first time, and I thought it was so cool, and all this other stuff, so I wanted to buy access there. I wanted to have some type of something to it because I just thought it was so cool and I actually never saw one so he's like oh yeah so break world access is so and so world locks I don't know exactly how much it was but I think it was three diamond locks uh, I know that's a crazy amount and pretty much I bought access for three diamond locks I was practically broke right after that I was like all my world locks um, but I did have like some like set art and uh, items and good stuff. Uh, I guess I did have some good stuff after. But uh, pretty much, I was I was friends with everyone in the world, and I didn't even have farm rules, so I didn't really break there. But I I loved all the other admins that worked there, or quote unquote worked there, and they were just all nice to me. So I was just making tons of friends and I like these people and then one day the admin or not the admin the owner tended to just I don't know he was like I said like I don't know I was dumb and I said I trust you owner I said that and then he was like oh hmm he trusts me haha <laughs> and then so pretty much I I I went to his world because he told me to go to his world, and when I went to his world, he's like, drop, and I was like, uh, and then he told, he was like, drop, and I'll get, I'll, uh, make you owner to the, the second, the second world, which wasn't an officially a thing, it was an empty world, and it just had the, like, a two at the end of the break world name. So I was like, oh, I could be the owner of it. Or he, he didn't say admin, he said owner. So I was like, oh, that would be so cool. And of course, like, I was like, all right. So I, dro dro I dropped and he was like, yeah, dude, if you trust me, you have to do it. So I dropped my world locks and he he took, or he didn't took, take it. I dropped my world locks and my grow board. And after... He'd taken my my Warlocks and Go board. He left the world, and I started messaging him. I was like, "Dude, give my stuff back. Give, give my stuff back." I said, "I trust you." And he said, y "You didn't fully fully trust me with this world." Cause, and then he followed me to the world that I was messaging him in, which was my world, and it was a vend world worth a diamond lock. It was only twenty five vending machines, and I bought them for four Warlocks each, each vending machine. And so this was like months ago, many many months ago. And so the vending machines were a little more cheaper than they are right now. And he was like, all right, give me world if you trust. And I was like, dude, you didn't even give back my grow board or my world locks. And um, he's like, well, then that makes sense. You don't trust me uh, or, or I can't trust you because you don't even trust me with your own world. And I was like, uh... <laughs> So then I, I, I guess he kind of, in a way, tricked me. And I was just so dumb. I don't even know. And so I I gave him the world key. And he had access to the world. Or not access. He owned the world. And what he did, which was the most dumbest thing ever. And I just can't believe it. And he took my... Or he... He traded me, and he, was, like, he put the key in the trade, like, as if he was going to give it back. And 
he just didn't give it back. He acted like he did, and then he canceled and left the world, and I was like, so then I went to my other, other world, and I messaged him. Same thing happens. He comes to my world, and at this point, I lost everything that was valuable to me, and I went to my world, and my world had, it was my only, my, my best farm world, MGZ farm, and it had a few, like, two, uh, 2k pinball seeds that was all I had left and or maybe it was only 1000 I don't know something like that and he took he took the world for me once again I traded and he said the same exact thing and I was so stupid and I fell for it so it was like <laughs> I, I, I didn't even care after that point because I was like I lost everything, and I was actually considering quitting Grotopia, and all that stuff, so I, I just didn't know what to do, because I wanted to quit Grotopia, and I was like, I, I didn't even know, and this was really early on when I started playing Grotopia again, and I, I was having so much fun in, with it, too, and I love Grotopia still, still playing it, obviously, and pretty much, I kind of stopped playing it and he sold my world so since my Ven world was one diamond lock he, he just wanted to get rid of the world he didn't even want it he sold it for a diamond lock he or not a diamond lock 80 world locks like that's so so cheap it was that's such a cheap and that guy profited he didn't give it back even though I told him that it was a scam thing um but of course he didn't because he bought it whatever but I bought back my farm world MGZ farm because I I have like a long relationship with that world, if that makes any sense. I've ha owned that world for like two years now, and I don't know. It's like one of my first farm worlds, and it's really cool. And I really like that farm world. It's super cool. And I bought it back. F he sold that world for six world locks. I bought it back for like like eight or something, like. Or no, not six world locks, like four world locks. Four world locks, I bought it back for six world locks, that's right. And I, I, after that, I had nothing. All I had was my farm world, and that was it. And then I kind of was like, I don't know what else to do anymore. And I was about to quit. And then I, I didn't quit because I just didn't. I just loved Grotopia so much that I just didn't quit, and here I am now. I still have World Locks, and I'm still very good, if that makes any sense. <laughs> Not very good. I don't know what you mean, or what I mean. <laughs> but, um, pretty much he scanned me a few Diamond Locks, and scanned me almost everything I had. And I'm still doing good, but he's a scammer. I forget the guy's name. Oh, he, oh, he's also... Like, he scammed others people's, um, all, all the other people's in the break world who paid for access. So yeah, he's a scammer. I can't tell you who it is because I don't know who it is. And he probably changed his name most likely. And yeah. and But there's a second time. There's a second part two, I guess you can say, but it's for a different bro break world. I'll tell you that if this video gets 10 likes. Look at the video, the 10 likes. That sounds like an okay goal. And... For now, guys, I will have to see you later. Subscribe to me, like the video, do all that jazz, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.